Hello, my name is David McGregor from Component Maintenance. I'm the Chief Engineer. I helped set up the wheels and brakes shop for 737s in Melbourne. So just to give you an illustration of the of the number of wheels and brakes we, we get in the shop, the, we have 70 aircraft in the fleet, each of them landing about eight times a day, and the tyres last only about 180 landings. So we get a lot of wheels in the shop. The brakes last about four months, and there's four of them each aircraft, and uh, they last about uh, a thousand landings or so. Some of our major goals as part of reintroducing wheels and brakes into our component shop in Melbourne was to ensure that we eliminated hazardous manual handling, have our staff involved from the beginning to the end, um, lowering our cost of maintenance and increasing productivity, and making sure that we met our target of no injuries to anybody at any time. After the design process, these safety solutions were implemented. The assembly and disassembly machine. These allow for the rims to be picked up and manipulated. The conveyor systems. Move rim from station to station without our staff having to lift or carry these. The wheel washer, which is connected to our conveyor system that individually loads each rim into the washer and individually washes them before moving on to the next station. The cranes individually pick up each rim and moves from station to station. The inflation cage. These inflate a tyre and re completely remove the risk of a tyre exploding. Wheel lifts make very easy visual inspection and the torque machine. Once we would have individually done up each nut, this allows very lean and safe process. Setting it up, uh, we're all consulted as part of the team. Uh, we all had our say in it, uh, gave our pros and cons, um, and yeah, it felt like we were part of the team and we had an influence in the way that the place was set up. Are you happy with the result? Yeah, yeah, it's good. It's good. Safety really is our first priority and we're really proud of this world-class facility. <laughs>